Lalak proceeds to say that Isaac was gonna pick her up from practice because she played a sport. Isaac was gonna pick her up from practice. They they were smoking and she sucked them up. This a reminder. How are we doing today? Hopefully we're doing absolutely a uh, mother freaking amazing, you guys. What's up, what's up, what's up? It's your girl, my name is Shucker, as you guys can see from the bottom right quarter. So I messed with my hair like hell today because I just installed this wig. I'm trying to get this video out to you guys by 7 o'clock. Um, for any new people, my hair does not always look like this. I promise you guys, my hair is always styled and looking, oh my goodness, I hate, I hate my hair. I, <laughs> I look like somebody mama. We hit 100 subscribers, you guys. We hit 100 subscribers, and I promised you guys that I was gonna give you guys a story time about how my man's messed with my friend. If you guys are new here, I know you guys wanna hear the tea. I know y'all wanna hear the tea. I know you wanna hear the tea with your pinky up because you're proper. Please go ahead and give this video a like because I know you guys are gonna like this story time. Please go ahead and subscribe to the channel because I know you guys are like. I know you guys wanna see my pretty, 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 pretty face every Monday and every Friday. I know I'll be posting on Monday sometime, it'd be Monday, but I promise you, okay? This Monday, you guys are gonna get another video, all right? I'm gonna speed this up, okay? Just go ahead, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and get up with me in the comments down below to me what you guys think about this situation because y'all is about to get messy real, 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 real quick. Okay, I'm a little bit turned down because I'm tired and I'm gonna take me the fattest nap after I edit this and go ahead and publish this for you guys, but like, Mama tired, okay, mama is turd. Okay, she's turd. All right, not turd as in in the toilet. I'm talking about turd as in T-Y-R-E. Y'all get it, anyways. Bitch, she's in the house. Wish she's in the house. In flesh. She did not like flesh, y'all. We're gonna go ahead and get right into this story time. So, Y'all already see by the title, my man's messed with my friend. I'm going to tell you guys how this happened. Winding to junior year of high school. If you guys watched my last video, it's going to be in the annotation right here. Please go ahead and watch my last video about when that boy, he wanted to talk to me. He wants to chill his girlfriend with me. Y'all going to, you know what I'm saying? This happened. This happened back in junior year of high school. Now, in the last video, click right here. The link will also be in the description down below if you guys don't get the annotation, which is okay yeah so if you guys watched the last video you guys know that junior year of high school for me it was like cool girl crazy drama drama for your mama mess tea every single day you guys know that i had nickels on top of nickels okay so let me tell you about this one particular nickel all right so his name is going to be called isaac let's call him isaac just a random name no his name is not actually isaac he was this football player um kind of athletic he was on a football team uh he was just like a cool person you know what i'm saying very quiet cool calm collected now let's name my friend who i found out did some things with my mind all right we're gonna call her lilac okay because her favorite color was purple so you know why i like purple you know junior year of high school me and lilac we had the same gym period together so um keep that in the back of you guys is mental because this is where it eventually all goes down me and lilac we had um a gym period together and in this gym period we got closer and closer lilac was like everybody's friend she was like that one girl who's like kind of friends with everybody and who can mingle with everybody like she can literally be friends with anybody because she's just like a cool person she's very chill very quiet but you know she's like a fly on the wall but everybody knows her and you know saying people like her she was very cool you know what i'm saying very cordial when we would have gym period together y'all when i tell you she would tell me all of her tea all of her gaga all of her drama i'm not gonna put it here on youtube because that's none of my business for real but she did tell me like all of her business i'm talking about down and dirty and all that she told me all of her tea all of her business, you know what I'm saying? One day we was walking around in the gym room and she brought up, um, what I name him? Isaac, she brought up Isaac, right? She saw me and him talking together, right? She was like, girl, me and Isaac, we used to mess around and we used to date. I was like, huh? Cause we was in the gym period class. We was in the, um, we was in the gym period together. We were walking around just, you know what I'm saying? Just so the teachers, cause you know, teachers, them funky ass teachers, they would've got on our asses. No, I don't even like that for real. Um, she was telling me how Isaac and her used to mess around and they used to, you know what I'm saying, exchange spicy, spicy pictures and they dated for like two weeks back in 
freshman year of high school. Mind you, I didn't know her freshman year of high school. I never seen them walk around together, but who the hell do I know? I'm not her, I'm not living in her life. This is my friend. So when she told me that her and Isaac was, you know what I'm saying, mingling and dingling around, I texted Isaac about it. I'm like, oh, so you dated my friend? That this time me and Isaac, we were talking. We weren't, you know what I'm saying, getting too close or whatever, but we was just talking. We was just chilling. We was just bada bing and bada booming. All right, I text him and I'm like, oh, so you dated my friend? He told me, he said no. I did not date her and he stuck by that to the day that I eventually just stopped talking to him. He told me he did not mess with Lilac, okay? So that's what he told me. He said, no, I did not mess with her. We just had a little thing. We just had a little spicy noodle thing, okay? But it was nothing like that. I did not date that girl. So whatever she's saying, she's lying. This is my friend. This is my friend, okay? This is my girl. I'm gonna believe her. So I was like, yeah, no, um, no, thank you. So I stopped talking to him. Her story of it was, was that she didn't have the messages from Snapchat, but they definitely like dated. Her story did not match up really completely. That's all I took from it. She just told me that they dated. He's telling me that they didn't date, but his story seemed a little bit more like believable, believable, like for real. I stopped talking to him. Scrap him trash. I have other niggas. Uh -huh -huh. Somehow, some way, he weasels his way back into my life. We get on the phone. This man is so adamant about them not dating. He told me piece by piece by piece. I don't know how you still remember this. He told me piece by piece by piece of what him and her had going on. Basically, because I'm going to tell you guys this, it was nothing that serious. They were just effing around. They never dated, right? He even told me that, you know what I'm saying, she had did some things with his friend. Anyways, he was just like, no, I wasn't messing with her like that for real. Like, no, we was not like together or nothing like that. It was just, you know what I'm saying, entertaining because the hell of it. So I'm like, okay, cool. I'm still really not believing him. So I told him, I said, listen, I'll tell you this. Like, we can't really, you know what I'm saying, become close how we were but i will definitely you know what i'm saying i'll keep talking to you because it was cool people's either way but like i just won't you know say flirt with you and just stuff like that so i said okay cool i'm not gonna flirt with you no more but we could just still be cool people seems like i bro he just really wanted to talk to me you know what i'm saying just to you know what i'm saying not dating type of talking not like relationship type of talking because i wasn't trying to be with this dude he knew that i had a roster i knew that i had a roster indefinitely so i wasn't trying to be with him once I, you know what I'm saying, made it clear what our relationship stance was, her, our friendship status was, he was okay with it. He just really wanted to talk to me. Time goes on, time goes on, and somehow we start to get, like, closer. <sighs> now, this is something that I still shake my head at to, to this day. We started to get, like, really, 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 really close. Now, let's pause on the story. Let's go ahead and introduce a new character. We're gonna name her Simone. It's not her name, nowhere near her real name, but we're just gonna call her Simone. So, Simone, that was my home skillet biscuit. I've been knowing this girl since I was in eighth grade. That was my, that was literally like my love. You know what I'm saying? I loved her to death. Just remember Simone. So me and him, we eventually start getting closer. Lilac, like, she's not really, you know what I'm saying, too pressed about it. She can't be pressed about it. She's just like, oh my gosh, like I see you guys are getting closer. She wasn't mad about it at all. You know what I'm saying? Simone, I mean, she was saying that we were like a really, 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 really cute couple, even though she knew Lilac's side of the story and Isaac's side of the story. She knew both sides of the story, but she was like, you know, you guys are just really cute together. I just love you guys together, da 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 She was my man for, you know what I'm saying, Good, my man. <laughs> Let's go ahead and fast forward, fast forward. So I want to say all of this drama commotion happened in December. We're going to go ahead and fast forward now to like May, right? That's like, you do the math on how many months that is. We're fast forwarding now. It's now May, right? May, springtime. It's starting to get hot. I'm talking about so hot outside, girl. Me and Isaac, we're like bonding closer. We're bonding closer, bonding closer. I told him I didn't... That just scared the mess out of me. I told him I didn't want to be in a relationship with him. He respected it. He didn't want to be in a relationship either. So I was like, oh, okay, cool. So we're just going to do our, do our thug dizzle. You know what I'm saying? So it really just got to the point where like people were starting to notice that me and Isaac, we were, we were doing our thug dizzle like you know what I'm saying? Out in the open. People were just like, oh my goodness, are they like dating? Like, 
for the dating. But I didn't really care what they thought. Yes, they did ask me. Yes, they did ask him. But I would just tell them, you know, I would just tell them like, oh, you know, we're just chilling. Like I said, we're going to fast forward to May. It's May time, spring time, good time, me time. I love when it starts to get hot outside. Girl, that's all me. I'm on the phone with Simone one day and this was after school I want to say this was this was a Tuesday Tuesday like 4 p.m. I was on the phone I was in I was in my kitchen I was on the phone with Simone I was talking with Simone I was like Simone girl like yeah me and Simone we would literally do this thing where like everybody does we would like be on the phone talking about school and the school drama and the tea so we was on the phone and we were talking about the tea but we talking about the tea and guess what Simone tells me she's like i would tell you something about a boy but i don't know if you still mess with him now mind you me and isaac we were still you know what i'm saying doing our thug dizzle being little secret admirers to each other but we were doing it like out of the limelight kind of i know i just said like people were noticing it people were noticing it but like within like the last couple of weeks leading up to this conversation me and someone were having we were just really you know what i'm saying been in the dark we weren't doing anything scandalous we just been low key with it well we're on the phone she tells me she's like i would tell you something about a boy but i don't know if you still talk to him i have to face this side so you y'all can see the bang so this side this don't look right this don't even look right this side this y'all get y'all this is most she tells me that so i'm like i'm like tell me because what you what you girl what you what you talking about i thought she was talking about buddy from last story from the last story i don't know what i'm talking about click right here a uh, click right here i'm thinking she's talking about him no i said girl who are you talking about she talking about some oh i'm talking about isaac when I tell y'all she rocked my little world with that one, she ate with that one. I said, girl, I don't, sir. I said, girl, what you talking about? Hello? What you talking about? What you talking about? So she tells me, y'all, oh my gosh, she dropped the bomb. She dropped the bomb on me, y'all. She was like, so Lilac told me, Lilac told me that she sucked up Isaac. Excuse me? Hit me, with, hit me with a good ear. It was like, Lilac told me that she sucked up Isaac in the parking lot. Girl, when I tell you. And it, you know what's so crazy? Y'all know what's so crazy? What's so crazy is, is that she sat on this. She sat on this. <laughs> she sat on it. Like, cause she didn't, I like, you know, you know what I'm saying? She didn't know that me and him were still together, but like, she sat on it. Like, okay, okay, okay. I wasn't instantly mad. I was not fuming. I was not foaming at the mouth. I wasn't doing none of that crazy rock rally stuff. <laughs> I wasn't doing none of that. I was just like, okay, okay. So when she gave me that information, she told me, because I said, girl, explain what you're talking about. Not in a pricing type of way, but I'm just, I'm like, girl, go ahead, tell your story. I'm like, girl, explain what you're talking about. So she explains what the hell she's talking about. She said, girl, Lilac comes in the motherfucking lunchroom. She gave me the date, honey. She said sometime in March, March 14th or 15th, but it was March. It was March that this happened. It is now May. Girl, go closer to me, girl, because we about to get into some things, honey. It was like in March, Lilac had came to the table. It was breakfast time. We have, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know it. Y'all know. It was breakfast time. Simone and another girl, they were sitting at um the cafeteria table. Lilac comes in the cafeteria. Lilac is like, I'm going to tell y'all something, but y'all have to promise not to tell anybody else. Lilac proceeds to say that Isaac was going to pick her up from practice because she played a sport. Isaac was going to pick her up from practice and drop her off at home. What ended up happening was, this is words out of Lilac's mouth. Lilac said that they, they were smoking. They got high off that Reggie. They went to a J.C. Penny parking lot and she sucked them up. Now, when she told me this, right, I was gagged. I was more gagged at, oh my goodness, why is my hair looking like that? I was more gagged at the fact that 
it was the JC Penney's parking lot. Literally, out of all the parking lots, JC Penney's, she wasn't driving. He was driving. He drove to a JC Penney's parking lot and he got sucked up there. Y'all, when I tell you, I gagged. <laughs> I was like, okay, girl, thank you for telling me this information, but I'm gonna see for my own two ass, honey. So I was like, okay, cool. So boom. next day was Wednesday. I was in. I don't even know what type of class I was in, but Wednesdays, Wednesdays were late start days, right? Late start days meaning you can come in at like nine o'clock. Well, school started at like nine o'clock, right? So cool. School started at nine o'clock. I want to say about maybe two hours. Two hours passed since, you know what I'm saying, all of us got to school. Um, mind you, Lilac was in the same grade and Isaac was in the same grade. Cool. I text Lilac. I said, Lilac, where you at, girl? She was like, um, hey, I'm in the lunchroom. I said, okay. Okay. I wasn't gonna fight her. For any of y'all wondering, I was not gonna fight her, but oh, baby, I was definitely gonna get to the bottom of this. Lilac is very loose with her phone. She was very loose with her phone. Like, it really wasn't nothing to get her phone right you literally she literally could be turned this way and her phone is like right here you can literally snack her phone up guess her password because her password was not that hard and you could literally be inside her phone and literally look at anything that's how that's how some people you know what i'm saying got a hold of some very important documents Go down to the lunchroom. I don't know what type of lie I told my teacher. I probably told my teacher I had to, you know what I'm saying, go ahead and diarrhea in the bathroom. I don't know. Lilac is in, she's downstairs in the lunchroom. Mind you, it wasn't our lunch period. It was the sophomore's lunch, lunch period. I'm like, all right, cool. Bada bing, bada boom. I go downstairs. I go inside the lunchroom. Fuck up to Lilac. I said, hey, Lilac, girl, Um, you know that dude that you was talking about? Girl, I had to, you know what I'm saying, make up a fake purse to, you know what I'm saying, bring somebody into it. I'm like, girl, what was his Instagram again? Give me your phone. Let me see what his Instagram is. Boom, secured the phone. She said, here you go, girl, go ahead. Because she was already talking to some people. I greeted the group. I said, hey, y'all. I wasn't I wasn't rude to nobody. I needed to see what the hell I needed to see. Bada bing, bada boom. I get that phone, baby girl. I was in it. I was in that whole like Pinocchio bitch. I went to the messages. I typed in I S A A C. I see his name popped up. I click on the messages and I scroll up. I scroll up to the exact date that Simone told. Oh, hello, Jesus. I scroll up to the exact date that Simone told me that it happened. March 15th. Okay, I think. March 15th. I scroll up. I see March 15th. I'm looking at the message thread. He's like, hey, you want me to pick you up? She said yes. He's like, okay. A um, couple hours then went by. He's like, hey, I'm outside. She said, okay. 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 Are we, are we, are we gonna get to the bad? I'm talking about we gonna get to the flow with this one. Cause that right there, that's crazy. So boom, I was not gonna confront her in the room full of mother freaking people i wasn't gonna do that don't do that that was just not that was beyond me i was gonna confront her in a room full of people i was not gonna do that my next period was my gym period like i said from before i said that me and lilac had a gym period together where she would tell me all of her tea girl when i tell you i gave her phone back I had to, you know what I'm saying, cover up my tracks first. I had to erase everything that I did to Instagram like nay happened. I'm like, all right, cool. I give her back her phone. I went back to class. Girl, 20, 30 minutes later, I was out of class and I was headed to the gym room. Y'all probably gonna hate the hell out of me. Y'all probably gonna hate the hell out of me. Look, 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 look. I love you guys. I love you guys so freaking much. But this story time is definitely, it's gonna have to definitely be a part two in it. <laughs> we gonna have to pause it right here. I know, I know, I know. Y'all probably, y'all probably don't even like part two. I love you guys so freaking much. I know you guys like this story time. I know y'all like to hear the tea. Leave off at the part where I said that I just found out that Lilac linked with my boo. And now in the next part, it's gonna be about how I confronted her. And things got so fucking ugly, girl. I'm gonna get part two on Monday. If y'all like this video, go ahead and like this video down below. Cause I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know y'all like the tea. I know y'all like the tea. I know y'all probably going through some tea right now. 
and y'all like it. And in part two, I'm gonna include all the messages. I'm gonna include everything. Okay, love you guys so freaking much. Please go ahead and like this video because I know you guys like the story time. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel so you guys can see my pretty, 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 pretty face every Monday and every Friday. Go ahead and get up with me in the comments down below. Talk to me. Tell me what y'all doing. Tell me how y'all think about the story time. Tell me what you guys think I said to Lilac. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye.